And today kicked off the beginning of a partnership between Beckley ARH Hospital and the state of West Virginia. That partnership will increase testing resources to help slow the spread of COVID as cases continue to spike. Newswatch reporter Shakira Hawkins has more from the ARH clinic. Jim Justice has strengthened coronavirus resources as the state reports a spike in cases. According to ARH CEO Rocco Massey, cases are the highest since the pandemic started and the daily positive test rate continues to rise. The uh, National Guard facilitated the delivery of 500 testing kits for us. That we will utilize this week to really improve the numbers of tests that we're doing here in southern West Virginia. The West Virginia Department of Health and Human Resources reported on Sunday there have been almost 300,000 total laboratory results received for COVID-19, with 6,854 total positive cases and 117 deaths. Today, I expect us to see probably two or 300 uh, individuals here to be tested. We've got uh, Jane Care Ambulance here helping us. We have some state resources. We have QLab resources in addition to what we normally provide. So as you can see, Sometimes we're running as many as two and three lanes at a time. As case surveillance continues at a local health department level, residents are encouraged to get tested as much as possible to prevent the spread of COVID-19. We also know that the virus is tricky, that you may not have any symptoms at all. So I think that for patients who decide to come, come out and get tested, they're protecting their neighbors, their family, small businesses from exposure. And uh, the more we can test in this area and the more that uh, they know they're negative, they're going to be a lot safer in terms of what, what they do in their daily activities. Reporting in Beckley for Newswatch, I'm Shakira Hawkins.